Welp, <laughs> here we are on YouTube. If you found us and you were hoping that we were doing a reaction to a song, well, we've done lots of those. And quite honestly, when you really think about it, what we do here, we're more of a discussion review kind of channel. So if you really want to hear some discussion and honest review of music or things that you're interested in, hey, join us. That's kind of what happened right here. This is Onion. And Onion, who has been supporting us for a long time, um, has given us a lot of exposure to Aurora. And we've really loved learning about Aurora over the years and, and understanding more. Yeah, this looks like it's no exception. It's a live performance we're going to see. And it's got Jacob Collier or Collier. I don't know which is the right pronunciation. Sure. Name of the song, A Rock Somewhere X the Seed. And it's uh, in. Support. Oh, I think it's two different songs. I think, sorry to interrupt you there. I think it might oh. be. Sorry, does anyone Live explain performance, it? It's not in one take of a mashup. Oh, it's a mashup between Jacob Collier's A Rock Somewhere and Aurora's The Seed, which, oh yeah, we've heard The Seed before. Yes. I'm a little confused because we haven't watched the video. Believe it or not, we're not a fake reaction channel. Oh, sorry. We're not a fake channel where we pre-watch things, then share Pretend our thoughts. We, yeah. yeah. We'll find out what what this is all about, but I think it's like, well, I guess we'll just find out. So it might be live-ish. Mm -hmm. Like... Oh, and I think it's a Greenpeace message too. Was that said in there? I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah, it was. To... Yep. Did you say that? Did I miss that? Uh, yeah, that's what Onion put in the. the... Yeah, supporting Greenpeace. Okay. Yeah. All right. Oh, beautiful photography already, though. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. I think you're gonna like the video. Uh, oh, videography. No way. <laughs> it's a piano sitting. Oh yeah, oh. I didn't even catch the piano. Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, so it is live. It's like he's going to perform it. Cool. Oh, that's iceberg. crazy. <laughs> we can hear the water lapping. Yep. I don't think it's an actual iceberg. I think it's... Right, right, right. Big, see that giant uh, microphone on the back of it? I'm on a rock somewhere. Hmm. It's the only one I know. And I know. Somehow I know you're there And I'm waiting on the world I'm ringing the old church bell See the people come and go And they go so well Counting the coins back there It's the only thing they know And even when I'm wide awake I know That you've been having other dreams for sure Nothing's ever gonna change at all I'll be waiting on the world Only waiting on the Hey, 
<laughs> you cannot eat money or no You cannot eat money or no When the last tree has fallen And the rivers are poison You cannot eat money or no You cannot eat money or no You cannot eat money or no When the last tree has fallen And the rivers are poison you cannot eat money oh That got me in the feels, man. This guy, like, what a fantastic voice. This is the first time ever hearing this guy. And he, really, he's got, I would say, a really unique voice. Almost like a classic. It's not a contemporary voice. He's not trying to sound like everybody else. It feels a little bit more like a throwback to older, older sounds. And I love that sound. His voice and hers just blend so nicely. The whole time I kept thinking, is this for real recorded like this? You could tell when he's moving away from the mic, it's, there's no question. That's a real recording on that little, whatever stage they were using. That's amazing. I, I liked everything about that. It feels like lately, Onion's really been giving us top hear Aurora stuff. I feel like the last one we did, we were, were just blown away by as well. I'm quite impressed with Aurora, the quality of this stuff we've been seeing from Aurora uh, lately. This is a song I'm like, okay, I want to just listen to this again. <laughs> this really is, is uh, solid. Of course, I 100% agree with everything you're saying. I don't know if there's enough. The English language sometimes sucks. It's hard to say all the things. I mean, beautiful performance, incredible message. I was thinking during just at the end there, uh, before the the graphic footage of the ocean uh, mistreatment of animals, but just I was just thinking about these two individuals on this beautiful water, beautiful landscape, cold, yes, but you know the beautiful world around them, and they're singing a beautiful song together. And there's so much ugliness in the world, Nathan, and I mean this both in the sense of what humans have done to the world and what they do to each other. Mm -hmm. And there's also places in the world where people live that's just, it's gross. I'm sorry, humans are disgusting people. <laughs> mm -hmm. They live in mm -hmm. shite hole situations that they've mm -hmm. created on themselves. Sometimes it's government related, I get it, but also sometimes it's self-inflicted. I see these two beautiful young people singing beautiful song together 
with a beautiful instrument, beautiful voices, and a beautiful landscape. Boy, I'm thinking to myself, now this is beauty. This is heaven. You know, this is, mm. Mm. you know, this is what it feels like. This the peace, the nature, and their talent. And of all the crazy and ugliness in the world is being spewed on X and whatever, just the social yep. ugliness, ugly images, and just then I watch this, I'm like, oh, no, there's still so much good and peace and 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 beauty in the world and i'm glad that they're showing us this and yes they're showing this is earth this is our earth this is our planet let's not mistreat it yeah beautiful i mean aurora is amazing this young man's name again was jacob he's 1.7 million followers on his channel so he's no slouch in the sense like he has a presence and he has a talent and i'm glad it's been recognized mm -hmm. i would definitely like to hear more from jacob a beautiful piano playing composition his voice was very unique a lot lower than i was expecting just from looking at him so when he started singing i was like whoa that the baritone voice that came out was very intriguing and they melded their voices together, both talent-wise and in message-wise. So, yeah, beautiful. The thing I'm, I'm pretty impressed with, both of them, actually, in this case, there's a tendency, unfortunately, the way that politics are today, it's very in your face a little bit. I didn't feel that was overly, like, this is the way you mm. should think. But the implications of, of what they're saying leaves right. it out there for people to interpret rather than for like in your face. Like, you should be, you should think this way. And politically, it's a little mm -hmm. bit more like we're hey. singing a song about how we feel yeah. about stuff and you can take what you want from it. And it's, it's not an attempt to try and make you think something. It's one thing to have a, what's we're looking for when you put a virtue signaling. That, well, definitely that we know aurora doesn't do that she's no. uh she's too sweet and good i hate to say you have aurora then you have no i won't say i react better to honey than i do mm -hmm. to vinegar i like what aurora is doing a beautiful person singing a beautiful song in a beautiful way and the message is clear now if you don't care people will hear that uh, scoff at it but that's just it she's not mm -hmm. preaching to those people she's she, i think she's reinvigorating people like me me and you like you know reminded us of the beauty of the planet so i appreciate that yeah, yeah, absolutely. Okay. Solid. All right. Good stuff. Thanks, Thanks Onion. Thanks, Onion. Yeah, great choice. Really great choice. I loved it. Check out the rest of our Aurora collection. We'll see you. Yeah, done a few. Done a few.